think I got a fish shot. <laughs> a little follow my toe. But he took he took my 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 thinker out. I was moving it. This guy was moving my thinker. <laughs> right. We're gonna have a nice fry today. For sure. I got a fish. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I didn't even know I had this fish on. Yes. Yes. I got a croaker on fish bite and shrimp. Yes. Woo. Yes. I didn't even know I had this fish on, yo. <laughs> nice croaker on fish bite and shrimp. We got our croaker. So happy about it. Nice. Hey guys, so we're back home. I'm going to clean up these fish. I have the palometer, a couple of other palometers, and the croaker. I got it right here. So I'm going to clean them up and I'm going to be cooking the palometer and some other small fish that I had from before. I'm gonna fry those up outside on a fire just for our snack. I haven't really had breakfast, but breakfast time has way passed. But yeah, I'm gonna fry the palometer and the other smaller fishes and the croaker. I'm gonna clean that and save that for dinner later on tonight. So let's get to the cleaning. Hey guys, so we're back in the kitchen. I actually did not want to do it in the house, but I had no choice because a lot of rain started falling like after I was cleaning the fish. And so everything outside got wet. All the wood, nothing left dry. So it kind of sucked because I wanted to have this whole jungle uh, survival feel because it's not really big fish. So yeah, but. This is what this is what we have. We have palometa and a couple of little pompanos that I caught on a on another trip that didn't really make the cut. But I can show you a little bit of how I actually caught it so you can see that. Again. 
got fish, they got fish. It's a pump for them. It's a keeper size. Yeah. <laughs> I keep in this one. I keep in it. <laughs> oh, the fish on here. Come on. Please be on. Please be on. A little fish. I think I got him. But if I do, he's really small. It's a little pump for now. And, and what is that? A bone fish? <laughs> a little pump on a bone. Yeah, it's a bone fish. Wow, look at that. A baby bone fish. On fish bite. And a little pump. Thanks. So I caught those fish there, I let go a couple of them, but it, it wasn't really a, a so much adventurous uh, trip, so it didn't really make the cut. But the fish is here, and we're just gonna fry these up with some bread in, and enjoy a little catch and cook. <laughs> so here is our breading. This is call me flour, flour, salt, pepper, and a little bit of cayenne pepper and garlic powder so this is our breading so let's get the stove lit real simple yep so get the pot hot and but in the meantime i'm going to dip these in the bag cover them up and let them sit for a little bit so that the breading can really stick to it and then put it in the hot oil. So of course I gotta put the oil in and I'm gonna put a little bit of butter as well. So, so I'm just gonna put some oil in and let that get heated up. And then when it's, when it's hot, I'm gonna add some more butter. But let's get a fish in the bag. Just rest it in the bag and it should like shake them until it's covered. Just like so we have all butter in and it's already melted. So it's time to add our fish. So our food's fish. So right in. Well, I think we could fit all of them at the same time, but we just do a couple a couple at a time. So, have that there, try not to move it around too much and just let it sit and then after that as it gets brown I'm gonna flip it so it's already smelling so good Ooh, I just love pompano and palomata they, they're like one of the best tasting fish I've eaten but whew, can't wait so they look just about ready to flip over so let's Give it a flip. Don't burn me. Don't burn me. Not 
That one needs to fry a little bit more on the other side. But Ooh. Yeah. Look at it. This one here is ready to go. Put it on a paper towel. Yeah. So he needs to finish up and I can get this one in. Yeah. So here is the finished product. Two pompanoes and one palometer. So let's get to eating. I'm gonna try this part, this pompano, because I just love pompano. So let's grab, I'm not gonna even sit down, I'm just gonna grab it right here. Nice! Ooh! Ah! So it's really hot still. Whee. So let's grab a piece. I don't know if you can see that smoke. Ah, it's just hmm. Let's film nice flakes like you can see the flakes just just coming out. You can see how the flakes are just coming out. Like oh my gosh, it just tastes so good. Like I think I really just want to target Pompano alone from now on. <laughs> like it just tastes so good. Like no matter how you make it. Mm. Alright. <sighs> okay, okay. It's so 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 good, so good, so good. But I'm gonna devour that because I haven't had lunch yet and it's lunch time. But thank you guys once again for tuning in to another Hooked on Sunday video. It was not exactly what I planned, but it's been a while since I did a catch and cook and I hope to have a lot more catch and cooks on the beach that's what i love to do i love to do it on the beach itself but it couldn't happen this time but it's okay we still got it done and i thank you guys for watching again and supporting and i'll see you guys next week